Key Real Estate, experts in equity. Okay, we have a uh, three bedroom, one bath property here on High Street. As you can see, it's pretty large, uh, two story. The house next door looks a little shorter, but anyway. Um, yeah, we're offering this property with uh, owner financing. Uh, let's go ahead and go on inside. We're gonna go ahead and start with the uh, basement, since that's the first door we're gonna kinda come to. So here we are, going up the steps. All right, and uh, have this door open here. Actually, we got lights on inside, but um, the light might actually uh, not be bright enough in all the house. Um, so I'm going to turn on the lights here real quick and turn on that right there. Okay, sorry about that. I want to make sure we got enough light going on in here. So uh, as we go in here, you can see we got these steps going up the stairs to the kitchen. Over here we have the uh, furnace right there. And then this just looks like a nice little empty spot in uh, the basement. Let's see, why is my flashlight not working? Give me a second here. Oh, it is working. Okay. All right. So, so yeah, let's see. There we go. All right. So, I <laughs> guess I should turn that light on too. But anyway, so as you can see, this is just, you know, run of the mill basement. Um, kind of like you see in most houses. There's the furnace. Looks like a newer furnace here. Uh, and it looks like it has a humidifier on here at the top. Okay. And uh, right here is the electric box. Hold on. I'm doing a new uh, product here called a gimbal, and it's going all over the place. <laughs> anyway, so um, you can't see it, but it, this is a um, 100 amp service. All right, well, let's go ahead and go over here. And here's another area in the basement. It's kind of like storage. All right. There's the water heater downstairs. Uh, it's kind of covered up, so it's kind of hard really to see um, uh, what the, uh, how new it is. But let's go over here. So I think we can... Kind of take it off. Yeah, definitely newer. Yep, electric water heater. Okay, I just need to slow down on this gimbal. It's, um, trying to watch where I'm going so it stabilizes, but then I move too fast. And then right here, you can see, we'll zoom in. That's the water coming in. See, we had to replace that valve when we bought it because the other valve was uh, broken off. Right. Let's go ahead and head on upstairs. We can look at the rest of the property. Okay, so up here we have the kitchen. See, there's a cabinets in the kitchen. And this door goes out the back side. And right here is the utility area. So you got washer and dryer um, hookups. The line comes up from the bottom for the hot and cold water um, there. So, okay, now let's go ahead and go outside. This is the backyard for the property. See, uh, there we go. 
And then right here is the steps. We are going, now let's go to the, uh, to the street down there where you park. Okay. Nice little picture of the stuff there. All right, so, and out here, you can see the, uh, there you go. There's the back door and the roof over that and the roof over there. Uh, no signs of any missing shingles up top. Um, also, no signs of water leakage or current water leakage, I should say, in here because there was a area where it looked like the water was leaking in the living room, which we'll see, but appears to not be worried about it anymore. Or it doesn't appear to have it anymore okay so this is the kitchen again and as we go in here we got a dining room slash living room area as you can see let's see nice and okay got that light on and the door just shut from uh, the wind okay so this right here is like a uh, the living room and uh, this door here goes out to a nice little porch deck area. And you can see they're doing a lot of construction out here, so it's really loud right now. But yeah, there's the street. Go back in where it's quieter. Too loud out there. Yeah, so like I said, uh, it looks like there had been some kind of leakage, I think is due to the um, uh, right there. You can see where they patched it up, but it hasn't really been uh, leaking at all since we bought it. So see it's dry, nothing showing as leakage. Okay, let's go ahead and head on up to the upstairs where you can see the there we go these are the stairs going to our three bedrooms okay let's go on up to go to the first bedroom This is the first bedroom here. And over here. You can see all the lights are working and stuff. We have the water and gas turned off, but lights and everything are electrics obviously working and lights are turning on just fine. This is the first closet. Okay. And right here is the first bathroom, or the only bathroom, I apologize. <laughs> so our properties have more than one bathroom, so. Looks like I need a new linoleum down here, but yeah. This property is pretty much ready to go, just needs a little bit of work on the inside to make it uh, your home, but it'll be your home. All right. Let's go on over here to the next bedroom. Stop. Sometimes I'm confused why. Okay, there's the bedroom. Okay. Nice and clean, no signs of any kind of leakage. Right 
right here is access to the um, water lines and stuff um, in the bathroom right behind. Okay. All right. Let's go over here to this next room. And there's a closet. This is a master bedroom. It's a little bigger. It has two closets. And yeah, that's pretty much it. And then right here, it's another closet that um, you can uh, make into a closet, but uh, just be cognizant or just know that this also is the access to the attic here. This is the attic access. So I believe that's why the previous owners did not use it as a, um, as a closet, but yeah, obviously it could be used as a coat closet or some other kind of closet that you'd like to do. And that's pretty much the walkthrough of this property. Uh, it's on High Street in Benwood, West Virginia. Three bedroom, one bath. We are doing owner financing on this property. I don't know if I got this for you or not, but here's a closet. Also up here, I think I passed this one. <laughs> I went to the bathroom instead. But anyway, there's another closet. So lots of closet space, lots of storage space. And um, yeah, just feel free to give us a call if uh, this looks like the kind of property that you would like for your you and your family. And um, feel free to give us a call and or email us. And all the information is in the description of this video. And uh, we'll be happy to get back with you. And if this you know, isn't the type of property that you're looking for, that's not a problem at all. We have other properties. If you just go ahead and look at the description of the um, video, oh, I'm sorry, not the description, you just go to our uh, actual YouTube page and you'll see a bunch of video or other videos of properties that we have available that might be what you're looking for. Anyway, we look forward to hearing from you and have a great day. Don't forget to subscribe to our channel to see upcoming deals.